What's up today, my fellow Madden soldiers? So what I'll be speaking about right now is Madden 21 team captains. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. So EA yesterday had a stream. They revealed mostly everything when it came to MUD, what we're going to get, the programs and so forth, at least in the beginning. Like, you know, initially when you log into MUD, things that's going to be happening right then and there. So they, they told us everything, the MUD master, everything else. But right now, what we're going to be speaking about is the team captains and which team captain should you get. All right. So I don't know if you guys know, I don't know if you guys are aware of when it comes to what they actually did this year with the team captains, but it's something that I made a video about and something that I actually wanted to see when it came to Mutt, when it came to the team captains. So anyways, I'm going to show you right here. As you can tell here, it says Anius Williams. If that's how you say his name, I think that's how you say his name, right? So... He is a cornerback, and you see that it has like a, a ton of 87 overalls of him. You're like, why does it have so many 87 overalls of him? So I'm going to show you right now. This is why. You, you see right here? Oh, so it's, it's, it's skipping right here, right? Let's keep on skipping from one. But anyways, I'm look, you see right there, it says Steelers theme team. I mean, a Steelers team Kim. He was never a Steeler, just so you guys know that on this one. It says Seattle uh, Team Cam. On this one, it says Saints. So as you could tell right here, one, one of the things that, that I was speaking about that I would like to see when it comes to Mutt 21 Team Captains is the ability of the Team Captains to get any Team Cam. So this year, Madden 21 and Mutt gave the Team Captains the ability to have any Team Cam. So once you click on... Um, while go while log into mutt and once you get your team uh, captain pack it's gonna open up and it's gonna ask you to pick your team captain then you're gonna be able to pick from one of 32 teams when it comes to the team cam that you want so i thought that that was pretty cool honestly i'm gonna be honest with you guys i'm not gonna put um any of these guys on my i'm not gonna put the guys on my theme team if they were never a dallas cowboy or if they're not a dallas cowboy but they will have the Dallas Cowboy Kim because majority of the people on my main squad, I'm talking about on my main squad, they will have the Dallas Cowboy Kim and they will they will be on my squad. But on my Dallas Cowboy theme team, no, because they have to be a cowboy or there or if they were a cowboy. That's how I just I'm gonna run it when it comes to a theme team, just like I did this last year. So that's one thing I want to say real quick. But anyways. There is two Cowboys, though, just so you guys know. Out of all the four team captains, there is two Dallas Cowboys that they actually added to um, to the team captain list. So I'm happy with that. But anyways, as you can tell right here, they're going to be able to get any team cam. So that's one thing I want to stress to you real quick before I get into showing you the rest of them. So let's go over here. So that's why there's so many of, of this Anus Williams guys. And the same thing with uh, LaRoe Glover is based on the fact that they're showing you all the team captains with each cam okay but this uh, Leroy Glover is a Dallas Cowboy just so you guys know I'm so ecstatic knowing that right off the top we're not going to be able to get both of the I mean all four team captains you're going to be able to choose one but knowing that that we're going to be able to get four and two of them are already Dallas Cowboys and I'm going to show you right now so this is one, one, another one which is a, de a defensive tackle all right Go to the next one. All right. So that's why there's so many of them. Okay, here's another one is Eddie George. Oh, here we go. Eddie George played for the Tennessee Titans as well as the Dallas Cowboys. So in Mutt 19, I had him on my Dallas Cowboy theme team, if you guys uh, remember right. And uh, this guy was a goon. Hopefully, he continue on to be a goon this year. And as 87 overall, he's already coming out with 85 speed. Um... That seems about right when it comes to Eddie George. Even in uh, much, Mutt 19, he was fast, but not as fast as, as you would think. But he's a strong power back, so that's what I liked about him. But once again, though, he's going to be able to get any team cam, so that's going to be good because I'm going to have him juiced up when it comes to majority of the people on my squad being Dallas Cowboy. And so that will pump that up. Now let's go over here. All right, so another another one is going to be Ed McCaffrey, which is going to be, they don't even say what he is right here. If I, if I, if I remember right, he's a wide receiver. 
Yeah, I think he's a wide receiver, yeah. And McCaffrey. And apparently he was from the Broncos. I don't know what other teams he played play for, but apparently he has a Bronco uniform on right there. I don't know why I don't say the position. Oh, yeah, it does right there. I'm tripping. Here it goes right here. Yeah, it is wide receiver, so. So, once again, he gets any team, Kim. So, I'll, I'm going through all the all the, all the the team captains real quick, and then we're going to go over which one, the best one you guys should get, right? But I just want to show you guys real quick who they Okay, so that's it. Did I already show you guys all of them? So, what, what is why is it not going back oh i did go back okay so cornerback oh yeah cornerback okay so we have a cornerback defensive tackle halfback and then wide receiver okay so them are, are all four of them right so anyways them are the four that the ea um the positions we're going to choose from now the best one to choose from right this is how i'm going to do it apparently Two of them are Dallas Cowboys, so you know automatically I'm ready to go. I'm, re I'm ready gonna go with the Dallas Cowboys, but it's gonna be the one that I'm basically gonna need the most. So for those again, for the what I will say first for those who out of the out of all these four captains, and when it comes to your team, like did it say for instance, I would pick the get initially in the beginning, even if you are gonna run a theme team, they just say, okay, you are gonna run a theme team. Um, and you're like, you know what? I want to run a theme team, but I also need this other position. Remember, these team captains, according to Kralo from EA, said that you, you're going to be able to trade these guys in, even if, if like, for some re reason later on, you find another position that you want, whatever the case may be, you'll be able to trade them in for another team captain. So with that in mind, just keep it, just understand, be like, okay, I want to build a theme team, but you know what? I need this position at first to help me be able to get the coins and, and build this, to help me be able to build a squad. I need, I'm going to need this position initially in the beginning to help me um, be able to do the things I need and beat the solos and so forth. Then what I would do is I would get the position that I need first. And then once you're comfortable, be like, hey, all right, I'm cool. Then go back and get the player for your theme team and trade them in. They say you're going to be able to trade them in as much as you want. Last year, there, there was a limit. But according to them, it says you're going to be able to trade them as much as you want. If they do that, that's actually going to be cool. I don't see why why they shouldn't do that anyway. There should never be a limit. It's your team captain. If you want to trade a man, you should be able to trade a man for someone else at any moment. Like I said, there shouldn't be a limit on it. But according to EA Kralo from EA, he says that you're going to be able to trade them, trade them in as much as you want and so forth. So... I'm happy with that. Um, when it comes to me, honestly, from the beginning, I'm going to get a Dallas Cowboy player. And the reason why, because I already know I'm going to end up getting the positions that I need. Um, if I do change my mind, then oh, wow, I'll change my mind. But most likely, like I said, that's really what's going to happen. Um, I'm most likely... See, when it comes to me picking the Dallas Cowboy, because apparently there's two of them. There's Eddie George and there's LeRoy Glover. That's really going to come down to the position I need. Most likely, initially, I'm going to end up getting Eddie George because I'm going to need a good halfback in the beginning. However, um, if I don't need a halfback and say, for instance, I need a defensive tackle, then I'm going to go ahead and trade them out and get the defensive tackle first, right? Um, until I get a good halfback. Because, like I said, apparently you can't get both team captains. But because they're both in the game, I know eventually one of them are going to come out as a legend. So keep that in mind also that whatever team captain we, ca captains we have, just like last year, most likely are going to... Um, are gonna get an ultimate legend or get a legend um, eventually so this keep that in mind but initially I'm gonna go with the positions that I need when it comes to the Dallas Cowboys and that's how I'm gonna pick my my team captain when it comes to your team captain like I said pick the team captain that you the, uh, the position that, you, that you're gonna need the most if you don't care you be like you know I don't care these um I'm missing well you know what it's not gonna matter anyway right and now that I think about it because I'm only speaking from the perspective of those who actually want a player that actually play for the team. But if you're not tripping on that, then basically, yeah, you could pick any player that you want when it comes to position. And is once again, they're gonna get they're gonna get any team Kim. So go ahead and, and get that player and add that team Kim to him. Just uh, if you want to do it like that. I'm just more talking about from the perspective of if you're running a theme team and you actually want a player that play for that team um, before or play for them now, whatever the case may be. So, but if you're not tripping on that, then of course, with every player you get, I, every player you get, I would I, I would encourage you guys if you're gonna have majority of the player from the same team, then go ahead and get that 
team cam of that of that team that you're actually running because of course it's going to boost your your team even more but anyways i would pick the position that i need the most of course get the team cam that you're rocking with um like i said if you actually want someone to actually play for that team and if you see someone here that actually play for your team that you want on your theme team because that's how you're running your team then go ahead and pick them up later but once again get the position that you're going to need the most in the beginning and if you end up getting that position and want to trade them out later on remember you can so just keep that in mind also anyways i'm gonna go ahead and leave right here if you guys like seeing what you what you've seen, drop a like if you guys any subs, subs to the channel. There will be more great amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. I'm out.